morning welcome to a new vlog and super excited to do this as always if this is your first time here my name is sugar and please do well to subscribe and like and yeah it's a vlog basically so what am i doing today i'm pretty much going to work and, and i want to show you guys that sort of so yeah it's a new vlog i think i have a fun weekend this yeah i think i'm gonna have a fun weekend so or at least things to vlog about so let me get ready i do receive a lot of messages after it and um he's a mixture in a mixture of different type of people i didn't really expect <laughs> that you'll get in contact with me but maybe i sent a message with the outfit i i didn't realize but yes it was a very interesting one mm -hmm. very interesting one. we have for well, larry fuck bad guy Oh, building <laughs> our friend. Yeah. Our actual friend. You guys, we threatened for Larry to be We actually threatened. Actually, I want to start <laughs> by saying that I called for Larry yesterday. Oh, my guy. Hey, what's up? Are you happy, son? What's, what's going on? you happy, son? I said, what's up? What's going on? And just like my normal request for every friend that I have in the industry. But I, I said, Larry, what are you doing this week? This week. Say his report. I said, fantastic. Perfect. <laughs> This is what we can do. I said, when will you put my name in a song? Now, Nairobi is is weird. Where it's warm, like the sun is really shining, like it's, it could even get hot. And then rain starts to fall. So you leave your house every morning, not very sure, especially if you don't own a car. Not sure how the day will be. So I always have to carry an umbrella. And something warm, like really warm, because like why work is even colder, so like it can get very cold. That's why I'm explaining what I'm wearing. I normally do two trips to work, so or rather two buses. So this is the second bus, and I'm alone, literally the whole bus. Yes. So now, if you follow me on IG, you know I always talk about do like my character chronicles on my story because this particular road distance from Karen to Kikoyo is crazy. Like I always have very, I'm always very interested in my tattoo, so. I think the point of this was to tell you that you should go follow me on Instagram. Plus, this vlog, I'm also doing a day in my life type of thing, which is like more interesting. I don't know how to explain it, but like it's like highlights of the way this day is gonna go <sighs> in more interesting manner, I guess. So, point is follow me on IG, and I hope this car is actually gonna work because what those things are usually about is entering cars that are solely running by the grace of god like jesus is literally the will because this matatu kikuyu matatu anyway yeah initially we had planned and we thought it would take only a few hours to have done with it but a 
upon reaching the venue, we found it occupied and we had to just wait the director insisted on the venue. So it ended up taking the whole day. And was that a fun experience for you? Having to wait to clear people, am I really just... It wasn't fun at all. So, it was a bit challenging, yeah, even though I managed. Um, what camera did you use and why did you use that I hope this works. Hello. Yo, 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 yo. In vlog days, I have just disappeared. But in the vlog itself, I know you're not feeling anything. But what's up? How you doing? So, started this vlog and then we've done two things that I did not explain what I was doing or share or anything. And that's probably what I want to do now. But how are you guys feeling though? Anyway. I'm getting ready to go for some sort of fun day, fun game type of thing. Very excited about that for sure. But before we go, I'm going to look for my glasses. I like sun shades. But even beyond that, I've done two things. I went out, actually went out with two of my friends <laughs> on these two occasions. And it just speaks who I am. Oh my gosh. Anyway, so went to Copper Ivy. Yeah, they always have these offers where they give you like a three cost meal at like an affordable price. That like they used to do 200, and I think Sikuizi did do, not 200, bro. They used to do 800 shillings. And Sikuizi, they'll do like 800 with like a, a cocktail and happy hour on a cocktail. So buy one, get one free. So it's almost like I don't get it because it was like you can only get one cocktail but like we were true so I was just like what are you saying okay I don't get it because we ended up getting a happy hour on two cocktails still and the cocktails are very very mild if you're not alcoholic like that like they're pretty mild and it's I think that's a good thing because some of us we really just like the taste I didn't enjoy it though it was just beyond mild it was it just didn't taste nice like i was just like i would just go because i normally just go for mocktails yeah i normally just do mocktails and i was like oh no it's okay you know what it's fine i can i can handle this and i just didn't taste good at all both but yeah so but the place is really nice the vibe is nice this sort of giving you what are they trying to give it's like bougie on a budget type of thing so you're going to see that you can see that now Oh my god, contact creators. You can't 
So yeah, she totally go to copper ivies. It's cool though, especially the offers. The food was nice. I enjoyed the food. And the thing is that the way they do the whole three course meal thing is like it's a particular menu for the day. So if you're about that meal, works. Then I also did a, uh, I just went, in fact, for me it was just hitting me like nobody vlogs that moment in like Kibanda's like like we all go to those places you know where you go get that chapo and then go you know <laughs> but nobody really like vlogs it so i was like why not so i didn't like vlog it proper but i just have a few clips there so you can see it <laughs> somewhere i don't know where they are i want to find them and sunscreen for the gold sunscreen lotion anyway uh yeah now i'm going to it's an event called i think organized by craft 360 think kibunj and his boys bro i had a whole moment where i used to hang out with certain people and i never vlogged any of those moments i feel very horrible some days but yeah uh kina kibunja and i know that it does not even matter really so yeah kibunja and his friends or his people or the people for crack 360 they're doing this sort of fun day type of thing they call it memory lane that's one of these things i don't want to go because you're just like i'm not kenyan but i'm going with a friend so i just want to have a good time so all those things i want to do in nairobi before eh. so that's where we're off to